Hi everyone, my name is Robin Speziali and I'm the national best-selling author of a book called Market Masters, Interviews with Canada's Top Investors. Okay, so um, this video is going to be special. It's my year in review. Um, it's a stock portfolio update for you from 2017. So 2017 has come and gone. Um, as I'm talking now, it's uh, January 2nd, 2018. Uh, and I just want to wish you all like a late Merry Christmas. Um, happy holidays and of course a happy new year for 2018. Um, I hope you had a great holiday season with your family, um, your friends, uh, co-workers, all those great um, you know office parties that happen during this time. Um, and you know thank you all for being watchers of my videos and if you're readers of my books, my blog, robinspeziali.com and my newsletter, thank you. I'm really looking forward to writing more in 2018 and producing more of these videos for you. Um, don't forget for 2018 to read my top 15 best ideas uh, for the new year. You can go on my website, robinspeziali.com, and you can see those your top 15 stocks that I have in my roster for uh, 2018. Um, I'm really proud to be involved with such a big community of do-yourself investors. Uh, most of the uh, readers and watchers of my video are in North America, Canada, and the U.S. On top of beating my um, uh, the S&P 500 in 2017, I also reached a new portfolio high, which I'll get to soon. But there's a bunch of other things I'd like to share with you, some milestones that I achieved in 2017. So in 2017, um, I've generated, uh, since uh, originating my newsletter, 1,800 subscribers. So I have 1,850 newsletter subscribers. And if you want to subscribe, go to robinspeziali.com and it's, it's all free. It'll always be free. I've sold 40,000 books to date. So I've written Market Masters, Capital Compounders, My 72 Rules, Lessons from the Successful Investor. Uh, there's a whole bunch of books that you can find online if you type in Robin Speziali books. In 2017, I also won the Gold Award. Um, for finance and investment book category from an organization called IPPY. Also on Patreon, uh, I'm a recent partner of Patreon and there I have exclusive content. Uh, if you want to become a member, check out patreon.com slash Robin Speziali. But I, I have over 20 subscribers now. On Facebook, I started up a, a club in 2017 and it's an, an investing club. I call it Capital Compounders Club where everybody talks about their growth investing stocks and ideas. There's over 450 members now. So go to Facebook and type in Capital Compounders Club and join. In 2017, I had 13,000 blog visitors with 26,000 views. Um, and you can go to robinspeziali.com slash blog and you can uh, check out some of the, the top posts from 2017, including my post on Francis Chu, who's a hedge fund manager, uh, value investor. And then there's Jason Donville, who's a hedge fund manager. He's a growth investor, though. And then finally, uh, my story on how I built my portfolio all the way up to age 30. I'm 30 now. Um, on YouTube here, I have over 300 subscribers. Thank you very much for subscribing, by the way. Uh, my goal is to get to 500 subscribers this year and to keep on producing quality content uh, about investing and to help you build your own portfolios. I've given 20 speeches to date on investing. Um, the highlight speech for me was in April of 2017 at the Fairfax Financial Annual Dinner for Prem Watsa, who, uh, if you're in Canada, he's considered the Warren Buffett of Canada. And I have over 1,800 Twitter followers. Okay, so now let's talk about my portfolio, my stock portfolio in 2017. It was certainly a solid wealth building year for me in 2017, and uh, as I'm sure it was for you. Um, my stock portfolio was up 22%. That's not including dividends. And that 22% gain for me in my portfolio beat the S&P 500, which is up 19%. And it also beat the S&P TSX uh, here in Canada, which is only up 6% for the year. Now, I'm always content if I beat the S&P 500 over the long run. That's my objective, generating alpha by picking my own stocks. Otherwise, Honestly, I would just dump all my stock holdings and invest in an ETF that tracks the S&P 500. And that's, you know, brutal honesty. Um, the cherry on top of this year was that my winners, uh, that is the stocks that went up, made up 80%. The lion's share of my portfolio went up. 
Uh, and that means that only 20% of my stocks went down. So I only had about uh, you know 20% that were losers in my portfolio. I always like it when I'm right more often than I'm wrong. And you know, in investing uh, and being successful in the stock market, a lot of top investors have said this over the years, it, it's probability. You just, you just have to be right more often than you're wrong. Um, you know, limit your downside, okay? Um, and then finally, I'm also proud that my predominantly Canadian portfolio, 75% of my portfolio is Canadian stocks, beat the S&P 500, which is, as you know, a US index. Um, and these American companies are the ones to beat over the long run. I've been investing in the stock market for over 12 years, okay? So I started when I was 18 years old, it was 2005, and I started with only $10,000, okay? And that was money earned through part-time jobs back then. Best Buy, I was a mechanic, I was a painter in the summers, and I turned that $10,000 12 years ago in 2005 to a $375,000 portfolio today which I plan to grow to $1 million by 35. So I'm 30 now, I have five years left. Um, if you've read about my story on robinspeziali.com, go to the blog, it's the first blog post. Um, you'll know that I, I, I don't come from a rich family. I don't have a trust fund, I've never had, had, had a trust fund. Um, I've had no easy access to a cushy job, okay? It's taken a lot of work and perseverance to get here where I am today. And it'll take more focus on my investment strategy to get to my goal. Though the power of compounding helps as my snowball gets bigger. Um, you can read about how I pick winning stocks. Um, if you go to Google, you type in Robin Speziali and beside that type in how I pick winning stocks. You can see my three pronged strategy and, and maybe you can you know, pick and choose what works for you. Now, hopefully you know, in the near future, we don't suffer a, a huge market crash. But if that does happen, I'll just honestly buy stocks on sale and push my $1 million goal a little bit further down the road. Ultimately, I want to achieve financial independence and do more of the things that I love. Freedom of choice. So my portfolio got a big jolt in the fourth quarter of 2017. And so that fourth quarter is October, November, December, the last couple of months leading up to the end of the year. As I shared in my bad quarter, um, that while Q3, which is July, July through September, showed general weakness in the small and mid cap segments and many of the new micro cap stocks in my portfolio, I expected some strength to return soon. Indeed, many of these stocks revived in the fourth quarter with a bunch of micro caps showing new signs of life in the last month of the year, December. I suspected a lot of capital in 2017 flowed out of those quality micro cap stocks to chase momentum in blockchain, lithium and marijuana stocks on the TSX venture. However, some of that capital might be returning to quality micro caps. Wild parties can't last forever. Anyways, I'll talk about my Q4 top 10 stocks um, in this video. And um, I'll also include those stocks in the description to this video. You can see the top 10 stocks in the fourth quarter of 2017. Um, you can also check it out on my blog, robinspeziali.com. But if you want a full portfolio update with my top stocks and watch list in 2017 and ongoing, you need to check out how to become a member on Patreon. Um, again, that's patreon.com slash robinspeziali. You can find more on my website. Um, there's over 20 members now, as I said before. Okay, so Canopy Growth, which is ticker symbol WEED, W-E-E-D, was up 177%, 177% in the Q4. It was the clear winner in my portfolio um, for the fourth quarter. In fact, WEED has now become my first 30 bagger ever. Some of you know that in my book, Market Masters, I revealed that I was investing in Tweed, the former name of Canopy Growth, predicting that it would become the leader in the marijuana market. That was all the way back in 2015. Since then, WEED has gone from $1 per share to $30 per share. But here's the problem. Weed's rapid price appreciation has honestly defied enormously its underlying growth and intrinsic value. I'm now seriously considering Weed's future in my portfolio, but I also don't want to be that guy that leaves the party early. Another stock that was a big performer in the fourth quarter of 2017 was Match Group. Okay, the ticker symbol MTCH. Match Group was up 35% in the fourth quarter, and it was a no-brainer for me. Uh, Match owns Tinder, Plenty of Fish, OkCupid, and a bunch of other dating apps. This is how everyone dates 
or hooks up, whatever you want to call it now. Okay. Plus the return on equity, the ROE is amazingly high. I love my capital compounders like Mash Group, which is among my top ideas for 2018, which I encourage you to check out um, on robinsbezali.com. If you scroll down, you'll see it in one of the links. Okay, so another stock that was a great performer in Q4 was Clairvest Group, ticker symbol CVG. It was up 32%. Clairvest was a surprise for me here. While I expected Clairvest, the private equity company with this prestigious Rotman family on the leadership team to be a strong performer, I did not forecast their partnership with Great Canadian Gaming to operate and develop for Ontario Lottery and Gaming Corp facilities west of Toronto. Though this is exactly what I want to see, positive business developments and pleasant surprises. I will be allocating more capital to Clairvest Group in 2018. So Savaria, which is SIS, was up 31%, two cows, ticker symbol ATC, up 21%, and photon control, ticker symbol PHO, up 21%, have been long-term holdings in my portfolio and continue to perform very nicely over time. All three stocks represent some of my biggest stakes. Finally, Amazon's continued ascent was really no surprise. Although, and an aside, Walmart's mega rebound, which I don't own, was a surprise. So here in rank order from top performer um, from one to 10 in the fourth quarter of 2017 are as follows. So canopy growth, weed was up 177% in the Q4. Bevo Agro, ticker symbol BVO, was up 56%. Match Group, ticker symbol MTCH, was up 35% in the fourth quarter. Clairvest Group, ticker symbol CVG, was up 32%. Savaria, ticker symbol SIS, was up 30.89%. Andrew Peller, ticker symbol ADW, in the fourth quarter, was up 29.89%. Pine Tree Capital was up 23%. Amazon in the fourth quarter, AMZN, was up 21%. Two cows, ATC, was up 21%. And finally, rounding off the top performers, top 10 performers in the fourth quarter is Photon Control, PHO, which is up 21%. So, you know, do you want to see my full results for 2017 and an ongoing basis, on a monthly basis, just like Netflix? I produce content um, on my portfolio. You can check it out patreon.com slash Robin Speziali. Um, you can become a member really quick. Okay. It just takes, uh, it takes about a minute now, January 2nd, 2018. So the, the day that I'm recording this video will sound the sound, the opening bell for the new year in my last newsletter issue, which you should definitely sign up to. It's free. I shared my top 15 best ideas for 2018. And you can check that out on my blog, my top 15 best stock ideas for 2018. And these are all stocks that I currently hold in my own portfolio. I really do hope that 2018 is another solid wealth building year in the stock market, although we will never know. What's important to me is continuing to beat the indexes, especially the S&P 500, and achieve a, you know, right around 15% compound annual return over time. What about you? You know, tell me in the, com the comment section here in the, the video, um, tell me about your big winners in 2017. What were the stocks that went up? And also, what are your top picks for 2018, the stocks that you think will go up um, in the new year? Um, thank you again for subscribing. Thank you for listening to my videos. I, I, I hope I'm, I'm helpful. Um, you know, I hope I bring new ideas to the table. I hope I'm helping you build a, a, a nice stock portfolio and helping you create your own wealth. I wish you a happy, healthy new year, and I uh, hope to talk soon. Again, this is Robin Speziali. I'm the author of Market Masters, and um, until next time, thank you.